Not a whole lot going on out there. Don't see any moisture falling over southeast Idaho or western Wyoming. Zooming out, we're not even seeing much for cloud cover, at least in our neck of the woods, and that's, well, why? High pressure, and that's going to be the dominant thing controlling our weather for the next few days. This high pressure moving east and with it bringing warm temperatures going into the work week this week. And, well, maybe a little bit later this week, things could break that up a bit, and we could see a little bit more of that monsoonal moisture towards the end of the week. Mostly clear skies tonight in the Snake River Plain. A little breezy. We're still going to see some of those winds the next few days, but they are tapering off a little bit. Pocatello, a low of 55 tonight. Idaho Falls, a low of 49. St. Anthony, a low of 47 degrees. In the Central Mountains, we're going to call it clear skies tonight with wind speeds of 10 to 15 miles per hour. Chalice, a low of 52. Salmon, 49. And in Stanley, we're dropping to 40 overnight. Upper Highlands in Western Wyoming, we got clear skies. Island Park, a low of 44. Jackson, 42. And would you look at Yellowstone, four degrees shy of freezing tonight. In the Southeast Highlands, mostly clear skies. Income with a low of 50, so does Springs 48, and Preston, a low of 45 degrees. Moving into tomorrow, we're looking sunny again for the Southeast Highlands. That high pressure is going to keep it that way the next few days. Income a high of 88 degrees, Preston 87. In the Upper Highlands in Western Wyoming, sunny and some afternoon winds about 10 miles per hour. Island Park, a high of 80 degrees, Jackson 80 as well, and Yellowstone, a high of 72 degrees. In the Central Mountains, Clear skies tomorrow and sunny. Mackey, a high of 85 degrees. Ledore, 86. Stanley, 88. And for the Snake River Plain, again, we're looking sunny there as well. 90 for your high in Pocatello. Rexburg, 86. And Idaho Falls, well, they're going to climb up to 90 as well. Let's take a look at our Southeast Idaho Chevy Dealer 7-day forecast. As I said, we're looking sunny for the next few days. Climb up to 97 by Thursday, looking very hot. But then clouds do come in and the chance of moisture increases as, as we move into the weekend. Sunday, a chance of some showers, maybe even Saturday night. Monday through Thursday, looking sunny and hot for Idaho Falls. A few more clouds Friday and Saturday, and again, maybe some rain on Sunday. In the Teton area, rain hits a little sooner. Friday through Sunday, there's a chance of some rain there, but the next few days are looking warm and sunny, that high pressure doing its job. 